Sure. including fertilizer. Honorable Director Murethi, from the opposition's perspective, what's your view of the past one year of the Kenya Kwanzaa administration? Well, I would have to say it's been a disastrous year because the Kenyans are by and large worse off than where they were 12 months ago. Uh, on the cost of living, it is clear that uh, just about the, uh, the price of everything has gone up. Now, cost of food has gone up, and you would think that might make farmers happy. i give you an example. Onions, the price of onions is up 22%. The price of milk, 14%, and so on. Beans are up 32%. So you might think the farmers are better off, but they are not, because the price of electricity that farmers are using, the price of, of diesel that the farmers are using, electricity is up 63%. Uh, uh, diesel is up 28%. Uh, Paraffin that we use in the homes is up 32%. So even though the farmers may be getting slightly more for what they produce, they are actually worse off because the cost of that production, uh, with the exception of this story of fertilizer, uh, the costs are up. If you look at transport fares from Gedorai here to town, yeah, just in July alone, the fare went up six, uh, 17 percent. So Kenyans are by and large worse off. If you look at the uh, debt and the management of the debt position, okay. this government has borrowed more, and it is borrowing at a much higher rate. I give you one example. Last Ju June, they borrowed in one week 213 billion shillings at the equivalent of 22.5 percent, right. which means you and I, as small businesses, when we go to our banks, we now have to pay 25 to 30 percent interest on our loans. So. Overall, okay. Kenyans are worse off, and I hope we get time to go into detail. Thank you. Of course, we'll get time to go into details on the array of areas that await our attention. We now cross over to the cabinet studio.